I'm making solid progress on Battle Babes. I've recently just used AI to implement solo rewards. So in the past, you could only get coins to buy packs by playing multiplayer and winning games in that. But when I realized that it's impossible to get two people to play at the same time, I had to do like a transition. So now the AI will reward your coins and XP and then you can spend them and actually like play the game. So um, the latest expansion is Battle Babes Lust, Space and Shadow. The Lust deck is, I'm gonna use different art this time. So I'm experimenting with different AI art generators. I've used ChatGPT for the majority of the Battle Babes art you're looking at now, but I've been experimenting with the free ones, like I've used Stable Diffusion in the past, so there's a lot of really cool models on Civit AI. So I've downloaded a pony model and I've got some good stuff coming out, so you'll have to wait and see. You can wish list it now if you want, but what else have I been doing? Um, I'm getting rid of the backlog of art from the Dale um, that you get inside ChatGPT4 whenever you paid for that. I was doing that in December, so the art you're looking at now is December to March from ChatGPT Dale. And then since spring, I've been using Automatic 1111, which is an interface for Stable Diffusion, the free one. I started off with Easy Diffusion, it's like a one-click install. And then a year later, I've come back to see what's new. And pony models have come out since then. And they look insanely good. And I would definitely recommend checking out my tutorial videos on setting them up. It's free and you can create beautiful art for literally anything. It's crazy what you can actually do with AI now. So my prompt for making this video is getting this solo rewards coding problem fixed like when i first started working on battle babes in january like the coding i knew was going to be my weak point i i've had experience with html css javascript doing websites and stuff like that but unity was new to me steam was new to me c sharp was new to me like the coding was really hard and then god the server side of it wow like i don't even know how i got through all that bit but Hey ho, we've made it through the, we've made it through to the other side, and we've got a, we've gained a lot of experience from it. But it was tough and it was really hard. But with AI now, I can literally take multiple files with Cloud 3.5 Sonnet. I'm butchering the name there, but Cloud Sonnet, I think the the latest one everyone's buzzing about. I thought, oh, I'll try it out because ChatGPT4. I've tried fixing problems in the past, but a lot of the times you're just you're chasing nothing. Um, but I thought I'd give cloud a go and it it worked straight away. I was like, wow, like I, it was so simple. Like ChatGPT was spitting out just loads and loads of nonsense. And then cloud did it in like just really quick. So then um, you only get a couple of charges with cloud. So then I'd like give cloud the cloud is like the bigger brain. The, <laughs> and then all the little micro tasks it would set out. I'd then feed it into ChatGPT, And eventually I got, um, the single player rewards working and then I got the end screen to connect and then I got it to like actually pop up and show it how I wanted like there were so many steps to it that if I did not have AI there is not a chance I would ever have stumbled upon figuring that out like it broke it down for me it taught me and I, I'm much better at it now so I can even target better so like when I'm trying to fix bugs in the future my understanding is better of it because it's explaining how it's doing things and it's just it's getting better, I'm getting better, and it's like, it's so synergistic, and it's just, I can't believe how insane it's got, like, it blew me away in 2022 when ChatGPT came out, and it's just, the images came out last year, now we're getting the music, I've been playing with the music, so, Battle Babe's soundtrack is just like nature vibes and birds and stuff, so, the fact, well, there's not, I've not found a way of generating stuff like that yet, but the music that's coming out from like Sora and stuff is crazy, but hey, uh, that's future stuff that I've barely even dabbled with yet. I need to get this spring to summer like art dump out from all the pony models I've been using. So that's what I'm working on this week and for the rest of July, then we'll expand and we'll see how everything's doing. I've just had someone um, from America, I think, just buy all the DLC. So it's really nice to just load it up and just see like it's active, like I'm getting like, 30 to 40 claims a day for the game 
Um, I recently got my 10th review. Um, 70% overall positive. <laughs> and then that got me put onto the discovery queue now. So I've noticed a jump that I'm just getting more people a day like hitting the page because of the, the discovery thing is now set up. You needed like 10 reviews to get a rating. So really happy with the progress we're making. Um, I'm excited to show off all the latest stuff and that's all. I'm going to stop waffling now. Go play Battle Babes. It's free to play and if you really like it, you can buy some DLC and improve the game and add more decks and stuff like that. So, love you all. Hasta la vista. Peace.